it's the way that it works. So here's, here's what we do in the Rockefeller Habits. We know this is the, the challenge, the, the battle that we're fighting. First thing we do is to get really, really clear on our strengths and weaknesses and where we stand and crystal clear on our core values so we have a stronger foundation. Then we take this vision and we clarify it and we amplify it to make it much more compelling so that we're driven, so that it bothers us inside if we're not making progress because we feel that we have to do something. And then we take these distractions and drains or, and through this methodology we use called stops and we eliminate a bunch of this stuff. We free up our bandwidth and get a bunch of it out of the way and kind of cleanse the system, if you will. Then to make it even more powerful, the third thing we do is that we pick you know, a couple of priorities, maybe one, maybe two or three priorities every quarter that we obsess about in a company. Very tangible priorities that we will take on or rocks that we will crush every quarter. So then we have a 90 day period where we focus on this, these three things here. And until we completely crush them, not play with them, not start them, crush them, finish them. Interestingly, as we do that, usually that adds to and strengthens our foundation. Our business usually gets stronger with each of these things that we crush and complete. Next quarter we say, you know what, we only have this one big thing we're gonna deal with. And we crush that. And again, adds to our foundation. Again, it's just a game. And we just keep going through this process quarter after quarter. And what happens at the end of a couple of years, two or three years, we have crushed more of these obstacles or opportunities than most companies would in a decade. We've done it in two years. And that's great for our progress, but we're also stronger and smarter as a company. So said differently, we get more of the right things done than other companies would. They're still playing with the first one or the second one. This all makes sense? It's a game, but the problem is, as human beings, sometimes when this isn't clear enough, we get excited about this, and then we get excited about this, and oh, we start this, but then oh, we go over here, and we just, we get distracted. So all this is, is a framework and a set of tools to get clearer on this, so it compels us like you wouldn't believe, and everyone in a company. To get clearer on our foundation and our values, so we don't deviate from them and undermine the structure to eliminate the noise that, that wastes our time on lower value activities that don't really do what we need to, and then to carve out and make such a high priority transparently on these things that will make a massive difference. And then we tell every employee in the company that we're going to crush those things this quarter, and it helps us to be accountable too. Right? That's the idea behind it. Pretty simple, and it works, if you have the discipline to follow through.